everyone, Paul Richards here with PTZ Optics. Now Pete Davis with PTZ Optics as well. Today is Wednesday, so we are doing a tech chat with Matt. Yeah. Um, so today we're going to be covering augmented reality. Uh, nothing too in depth, and maybe a little sliver that most people don't often think about. Um, so when people think about augmented reality at the moment, hot topics like the Microsoft HoloLens come up. However, at the moment, there's been some existing uh, technology and augmented reality going on for a while that actually helps people with issues in their day-to-day -day lives. Uh, one such application that's out there at the moment is by a gentleman named Dan Kaminsky that you may be familiar with. He made a, pro or a uh, program called DanCam. What DanCam does um, is it allows people who have color deficiencies, often referred to as being colorblind, um, to actually see the colors that otherwise they aren't able to see. Um, so you're able to, to literally experience the world in a way that you never did before to solve a problem that somebody has. Um, you know, the stories about people utilizing this program uh, go from a gentleman who always got laughed at by his wife for choosing really horribly colored clothing to the first time he was able to go into a store and pick out a shirt that his wife didn't laugh at him about. He best feeling in the world. Um, so let's take a quick peek at the DanCam software. Um, so what we've got here is actually a gentleman who's utilizing the software to look at a color blindness test. And what you might notice is how faded the images are or possibly how difficult the numbers are to read on this test. Using the app, you can actually tell it what type of color blindness you have and then fine tune for your own needs and it will actually help you to see the colors that you never saw before. Um, if we take a look at the uh, next one, you're actually going to see an example of unfiltered versus going through his, uh, his software. Uh, and, and right away, the, the differences become quite astounding. Uh, now, how this applies to the real world um, would actually be in our next little image here. And you're going to see, uh, here's the colors as they've been corrected. Here's somebody actually now using that setting to look at a shirt. And it might be the first time they're ever actually getting to see that that, that shirt has a pink color to it. Um, so what, what I've done is a little bit of research here is there doesn't appear to be anything other than a couple of kids in uh, Scandinavia that built a little WebRTC platform uh, that allows colorblind people to do video conferencing um, <laughs> and actually get to see the colors. Uh, so what would be really neat is to see a piece of software like ManyCam, SplitCam, or even better, see it built into something like Zoom or Skype so that for people who have color deficiencies, the software can actually solve this problem for them. They can have meetings, they can interact, talk about products and design um, in a way they never could before. Um, this has been my little thoughts on augmented reality. Uh, I hope. Yeah, thanks for joining. I mean, I'm colorblind, so <laughs> uh, you know, I think a lot of men are colorblind. Yes, mostly men. Uh, there's a small percentage of women out there apparently as well. It's like 0.5% or something. Very, very low in comparison to men. Um, but it is a problem across the board. Great. Well, so this is a way to video conference. You can't add this to any video conference platform. It's just a specialized WebRTC platform that has been created. That's correct. Um, so in seeing these kids having done it, it would be great to see some of these bigger companies jump on board. Most of the homework's already been done. And at least add it as a checkbox feature so somebody who is colorblind can now deal with that problem. They no longer have to just be okay with it the software can help them solve their problem. So this has been Tech Chat with Matt on Wednesday. It's our third vlog ever. I hope you guys uh, are enjoying this. Feel free to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Check out our live Friday webinars. We do every single Friday. Tips, tricks, and tutorials, free virtual sets. We've got a lot of stuff for you guys. So please click that subscribe button, and thanks for watching. Bye, everybody. Bye.